Yo, everyone, Fox there. Welcome to week three, I think, of the ICP. Yeah, we're facing uh, just Lucas and the Hellblades of Volcaronas. Um, he has about one of the best teams I've ever seen, I think. <laughs> like, at least he has one of the best matchups I've seen in a while. Uh, Kyurem absolutely rapes me, a land or his ghost, and he has a Reggie Lecky that is actually really threatening. So I'm bringing a different kind of team than that I'd usually bring, but let's just press A. Uh, a different type of team than that I team that I usually bring, but um, yeah, this is basically what I expected, right? Um, yeah, this is almost exactly what I expected. Jellicent. If it's Specs Jellicent, I, <laughs> I thought Specs Jellicent and Mox. Specs Jellicent actually rapes me. Uh, that's not a joke. That's like such a scary mon. Um, I'm sub toxic per second, Zygarde. <laughs> um, let's see, I think I want to lead Klefki. Because if he leads Kyurem, I'm on the back foot immediately. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm just... I'm Subtoxic Protect Zygarde. Uh, clear Smoke Among Us. Special Dragonite with Hurricane. To catch his physical switch into our guard. Um, yeah, just Bandit, Oshifu, Scarf Spectria. Because Scarf Spectria actually does really well against this team. If I can get the Snorlax to go. Jafar is the... Okay, this thing. That's annoying, but I'm out immediately. <laughs> I'd like to keep my uh, my shotgun intact. I think it's just U-turns. Um, I think Dragonite's the Swidgen. But, like, I had defensive Dragonite on a previous build of the team, and then my friend was like, okay, special Dragonite is kind of good here. And I listened, so now I don't have a switch into Landorus. Which is annoying, but he EQs actually. Okay, great. Um, I think switching is wheezing. I think I just Hurricane here. Hurricane seems like a really good play because he doesn't have Jirachi, so I don't need to predict Flamethrower or anything. With draws. Mr. Monoxide. Yo, give me, give me big damage on this thing. Give me big damage on this thing. Urshifu absolutely goes ham if this is what... Hit. Oh, that's so dumb. That's... Indescribably dumb. Because now, I like... The play is, if I get Urshifu in, first thing I do is I predict and I Iron Head, right? Because then the rest of the game I can just freely click Wicked Blow. That's the plan. But the fact that I miss a hurricane there, I miss like a free 50%. He doubles. Goes into Landorus actually. Okay. As far as I am concerned, I get a free spore here. Yeah. I think I do. So I just click spore here. I don't necessarily need to switch in my Dragonite on this, because I think he just U turns, yeah. Doesn't seem to be banded, at least. Um, only important sets. Amoongus against uh, Landorus. It is Therian Scarf. Oh my god, this is huge. Please don't be goggles. Oh my god. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I thought it was neutralizing gas. Um, hmm. Okay, not paying attention. Uh, yeah, not a good play. I could have, like... It's not like I have a, bad, a better play, is it? <laughs> it's not like I have a better play. Uh, but he's a terrain, which I completely didn't see. He's sub, okay. Completely fine. Sub is completely fine. Because then at least it's not specs. And Specs absolutely, like, Specs absolutely rapes me. I just, uh, Draining Kiss here. To break this up, and then I either set a Spike. Okay, I'm sure okay. Not concerned by this yet. And I probably gain most of this back, just by Draining Kissing. Yeah. I need to be a little less nervous. I'm really nervous about this matchup because I know it's it's a really bad matchup for me. Okay, sub faded.
I honestly think he switches. Okay, the mist is gone, at least. Uh, do I set a spike? Do I just throw off a toxic? I think I might just throw off a toxic. Maybe he wants to stay in. Okay, that's great. Hit, yeah, thank you. He either U-turns or Earthquakes. I don't necessarily think he Stone Edges. So I think the play is Dragonite, right? Yeah. <laughs> Because my Amoongus doesn't take an earthquake like as well as I would like it to. I have a bit in Spidef. So uh, Dragonite is the play here. And he U-turns, yeah. The thing is his pivoting core is a lot better than Minus. Like Minus just teleports Slow King, <laughs> which I don't even bring. So uh, and I don't even have U-turn on my um Ashfu. So I'm playing uh, more defensive than I'd like to. For a big part of the game. This thing comes in again. Hmm. It's an annoying set, don't get me wrong, but Specs just absolutely rapes me. Um, He can sub if he wants. He makes a double into six feet under. Okay, cool. I think... I think I might set up a spike. I really like spikes in this game. Yeah, so that's a free spike. Misty Surge, not um, neutralizing gas, Simon. Please pay attention. <laughs> but we set up a spike, which is nice. Um, I think I still go Amoongus and then double into Ashifu. If he doesn't double on this turn. That is. Playing for one. That's cool. Shouldn't do it over half. I think this is a free curum for him, right? In essence. So I'm just gonna go Ashwe. Oh, I withdraw first. That isn't good. That isn't good. Uh, please don't burn me <laughs> if you go for it again. Goes for Wisp in its own protective mist. Okay. Appreciate it. But you can go for a free fairy move here. Which is not necessarily what I want. So I go into uh, my Amoongus. Okay, aggressive double did not work out. <laughs> um, strange team, yeah. As could be expected. I need the mist to go. Um, let's see. I feel like I'm not really achieving much. Let's double into Spectria. Batman. Yo, what a switch. Really unfortunate switch for me, of course, but yeah. I think he just clicks Darkest Lariat. You don't click Body Slam on this turn. There's no way you do. So I go into Ashfu. Yeah. There's no way you click Body Slam on this turn. 
if you do, you're a madman and a really good player. <laughs> but I think Ash, who is kind of a decent surgeon, yeah, just takes a Dark Lariat, Darkest Lariat really well. Um, I Aryan had this turn. Because I think his wheezing is the switch in, and then if I iron had it once, I get to click weak and blow for the rest of the game. Yeah, so your terrain to your first gonna take a spike. Which is good. That's good, that's good. Your helmet, which um which is expected, I guess. You don't want me to U-turn all over your team. So you either go Jellicent or... Uh, you either go Jellicent here or... Um, Reggie Lucky. Both of which I'm fine with. To be honest. My Amoongus set is so useless this game. I don't get to score anything. Goes into Jafar, which is toxic, but he does get the Intimidate off. This is going to do a little bit. It's going to tickle, plus it's going to take Toxic Chip, which is good. Um, I just go Dragonite here, I think. Dragonite is really not doing as much as I would like it to. <laughs> uh, if I would just hit that Hurricane, you know? If I would have just hit that hurricane. But I'm just getting U-turned all over. But at least... Um, like, what is this switch in now? It's Kyurem, right? It's Kyurem, 100%. BMG. Regilaki, okay. Spikes are putting in some work. I go Amoongus here. Also, the terrain really hinders me from subtoxicking with my with my Zygarde. Oh, that sucks. I need to get rid of the wheezing. I really do. Spins away the spike. I think I just double into Zygarde here, actually. Because either you U-turn, or either you, either you Volt Switch, Ice out. Okay, yeah, that's not a that's not a favorable switch at all. Days is out. Um, yeah, this Kyurem's gonna stick to me. It really is. But he should be scared of a dragon move. I think I might be able to click a sub here. He might be scared of an of an outrage, which is what I'm, I'm hoping really. So I just click sub, and he freeze twice. Okay, cool. If I had outrage on this set, oh, I I would have just got rid of Curum. That would have been so good for me. Going to Klefki. Withdraws goes into this thing. Well, at least he's, he keeps taking to uh, poison chip. So I'm just gonna go. Like, he keeps U turning. I know he keeps U turning. But, ah, uh, 
I can't lose my Klefki. If I lose Klefki, Kyurem absolutely fucking wins. Like, I, I lose two mons every time Kyurem comes in. Like, that's how bad it is. See? Okay, and now he actually Earthquakes. So I make the good play. I make the correct play. Which I'm happy about. If she would hit Hurricane, that would be cool too. I think Jellison's the switch here. Now that he knows I'm special. Now that the element of surprise is gone. Would have liked that chip on Weezing a little earlier in the game. That does... Oh, that does so much. Um... I'm on Hurricane again. Do you think he has Ice Beam? He has Ice Beam. Damn. Uh, playing way too risky. More risky than I need to. But I just go Ash for here and I pick up a KO with Wicked Blow. Dragon I put in Sunlight's chip on the Jellicent. But I don't think I needed to lose it. Bad play on my end. Um But I think I think we pick up a KOA. And let's see. No, even if he goes into Lanaros and it's scarfed, we pick up a KO. Better yet, I think even if he Let's see, Mr. Monoxide, yeah. Two Wicked Blows will KO you. We will take a uh, Helmet Chip. We have to take two ticks of Helmet Chip, which is annoying. It's just gotta be that way. It's just gotta be that way. Um, so let's... Ah. Kyurem is such a threat. The thing is, if Kyurem gets up a sub, I think it just picks up two KOs if my Klefki has gone. So we need to just make sure that Kyurem doesn't get to come in. The thing is... Okay, Regia Lucky comes in. I either pull a really passive switch into... I get to spoil something for free. Or he has the Volt Switch. Any, anyhow, any who. I think I just go into Zygarde here. Does your Volt Switch? Extreme Speeds. 116 down to 45. Um, I can go, I can go Amoongus and Spore something, right? Yeah, this game is, I don't know, it's just tough. It's just really tough. Extreme it shouldn't do over half. Yeah, doesn't do too much. I thought a no item um, acrobatics. Uh, what's it called? Like, oh, I, I I clicked it into rain again. I clicked it into rain again. I'm so, I'm not paying attention. I'm just not paying attention. Oh, I hate myself so much. I'm just not paying attention. Uh, at least I kind of want to be on this thing. I'm just not paying attention at all. Um, I think I just foul play. I'm just really not paying attention. He crash. Okay. Uh, shoot and kill. But does a ton. Okay, so 
looking at his team. I think I might just sacrifice Zygarde here. There's always the chance that Heatcrash does not kill Zygarde, but it probably does. I'd rather keep Amoongus around for a bit. Um, There's the chance that this doesn't kill, but it probably should. Hammer Arm, okay. Damn. Damn. Um, let's see, my Ashifu uh, set against his uh, Snow Lax. And we could load us 82. The thing is, Kyurem just kind of wins. I'm actually lucky, kind of wins. So I just click Wicked Blow here, there's no reason to click anything else. Sacrifice the Landorus. Yeah, I kind of see this endgame playing out quite badly. I've not been playing well. I've not been playing well. Um, I think I'm so used to playing in mocks against not um, non-terrain wheezing that now I'm just kind of misplaying a lot. I'm kind of nervous. I'm kind of nervous for this one. Not gonna lie. Let's see. Wild Charge. Is, is it fully physical? So it probably either Volt Switches out. Oh, the thing is, I don't want to give the... I don't want to give the Pyram a free switch in. Like, if it's Immunity Snorlax, that's fine. That really is fine by me. I spawned this. Which is cool. The first sports are actually hit. Um, the thing is, I don't want Kyurem to get him for free, so that's why I spawned there, even if it was Immunity. So I just double into... Like, the chance he doubles into... Um, Regilecki is, is kind of big, right? Okay, this is fine. Super, super fine with this. Because I outspeed and I get to click. I think I just get to kill, click close combat. Because if I don't click close combat... I don't think I have any way of breaking. I can also click Ironhead for a mid ramp play. Because Ironhead kills right against A. Uh, Ironhead does KO. Okay. I just click close combat because I don't mind if the, if the Jellison comes in. I uh, should have just clicked Wicked Blow. Should have just clicked Wicked Blow. Um, he hasn't sat out a sleep turn yet. So now I go... Spectre. The thing is, uh, Wicked Blow doesn't kill Kyurem. And then if Kyurem kills my Urshifu, I lose the game, guaranteed. Okay, this, this is actually fine. Uh, do I just Shadow Ball here? I think I do. I can't let him stay, like, I can't let him stay in. Okay, so I made the correct play. 
almost doubled. Freeze dry. Don't freeze. Okay, that's fine. Am I okay with... I think I kind of do double now. Like, he can't lose his Kyurem. He can't lose his Kyurem for sure. He can't lose his Kyurem, I think. He needs his Kyurem to win the game. So if he freeze-dries freeze dries on this one, it's just a really good, really good read. Yeah, really good one. Really good play. That's such a good play. Um, is there any way we're winning this? Should have just Shadow Bolt. I would have had a Kurum. And then I just... Huh. Yeah. I just... I, don't, I think if I, if I don't Draining Kiss, I might lose. Because if he stays in, he withdraws, goes into Snorlax, I think. Yeah. That's a good one. Is it lefties? It's not lefties, actually. Do you think it's stick fat? Or immunity? I want to set spikes. Yeah, he crash is going to do a ton. Um... Toxic is my only play, I think, because I don't, like, I think if I don't Toxic this thing, it might be immunity, right? It's not immunity. So at least that's the thing. But it might be rest. It's a berry. Okay, that's a good one. Um, yeah, I just... I don't even think that play was necessarily throwing. I think if he loses his cure, he loses the game. But that's just uh it's a good, it's a really good play by him it just is i try to stall poison technically out speed is it a speed high uh snorlax It is a speed sign. So it would be unfortunate if he gets to move first. <laughs> Does anything in moves do? Does anything in moves can do actually? Yeah, Falfe has a chance to break up. So. 
I can't spore because the the thing is is asleep. Okay, so this has a chance to break up, but it would be unfair if it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't. Uh, he actually gets to click Ruse here if he wants. Yeah, it's just really unfortunate. Really not, really not much more to say. The freeze drive was such a good play, man. I really think he needed to save his Kirim to win. But then again, it wouldn't have been such a bad thing. I just wish he would speed up. <laughs> I just wish he'd kill me. Um, but I, uh, I guess he just wants to play it safe, which I, which I understand and agree with. Yeah. Oh, I got frozen. Which is cool. Let's see. I just wish he'd kill all my mons. Uh, please just, please just finish me off. Finish me off. Oh. Uh. I definitely don't think this was like I definitely played in a way that I was that I would have been able to win, right? Cause I just I just needed to shadow ball. I just needed to get Spectre the kill. But I think if I would have gone Okay, so looking back at it, my win con is keeping Ash for alive at all at all costs, right? So, I think if we play this game correctly, uh, let's just reveal taunt. Because <laughs> he just gets to go, uh, he just gets to go Snorlax anyway. Um, so my win con is keeping Ash for life at all costs. So in that in that aspect, it's a misplay, right? It's a misplay. Um, yeah, that's the only thing that can make it. But then even then, I think he he ends the encounter with more sacks, and then Reggie Lucky just kind of wins. But that I don't know. But it's a very good, very good game to uh, to Lucas. GG. Um. His channel will be down in the description together with everybody else's. Um, he played a, he played an amazing game. He has an amazing team. Uh, and he played it really nicely. So uh, please go check him out. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.